Hallelujah. Let's give him a clap, praise. Amen. Yeah, How you been doing? Amen. Jesus came into your life. Amen. We thank and praise God. Amen. We thank and praise God for Himself. And we thank and praise God for Jesus Christ. And we thank and praise God for the Holy Spirit. And we thank and praise God for Bishop and Apostle Hussey. Hallelujah. And the good Lord did God well and the Lord. Glory to God and all that is in attendance on tonight. Amen. Glory to God Almighty. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. We believe in God. Move on tonight. You know, the Holy Ghost has been here ever since Pentecost. Amen. You don't have to call for it on the terrace, for it. Just believe and receive. That's all you got to do is believe and receive. Yes, sir. Amen. All my stuff. Everywhere I felt at the same time. Is that right? Amen. So all you have to do is believe and receive. Amen. I will skip to put it tonight in Acts 1 and 8. And you shall receive power. Now <laughs> <laughs> the Holy Ghost to come upon you. Hallelujah. That's how we skip the for tonight. <laughs> Amen. We're not going to tear it. Amen. We're going to move right along. Glory to God Almighty. Hallelujah. Amen. And do the speaker. Amen. Glory to God Almighty. The woman I met about 21, 22 years ago. And she came into my heart. Glory to God Almighty. Hallelujah. Been there ever since. <laughs> Glory to God Almighty. Amen. The woman that I love. The one that God gave me. Yeah. Amen. If nothing I picked on my own, God gave it to me. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Glory to God. That makes a difference. Is that right? Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. That don't mean everything won't be just lovely, it doesn't. Because yeah. see, God uh, brought uh, Eve out of Adam. And they had the greatest father that could ever exist anywhere. Yeah. No one greater than God Almighty. Yeah. But yet and still, they did what? Messed up. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty. But we're going to have a great time on tonight. I know it's, he had a great time last night, the night before that, the night before that. And pray that it get greater and greater. Like I said, gooder and gooder. Every night. Hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty. It's a blaze of us. Blaze on the Holy Spirit of here. Glory to God Almighty. So I know I got to get out of the way. Amen. Well, I am not the speaker, but I'm going to present you some and introduce to others this great moment of God. Papa Church. Apostle. Doctor. Ida Moore. And Pastor. I'm going to say, God bless you. Praise the God, praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. You know when you come, when you come in, grin. See, I came in, grin. That let me know He was here. Amen. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. Glory to God. I thank God, Amen, for this blessed opportunity. Amen. Hallelujah to be used of him tonight. Amen. To God be the glory. Amen. Hallelujah. Thanking the Lord. Amen. For this powerful man and woman of God and free gospel deliverance. You know, I love that name, free gospel. Amen. The gospel is free. Oh, glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord God. Father God, right now, in Jesus' name, I yield myself, Lord God, that out of decrease that the Spirit of God in her would increase, O oh God, that you would give us a word in season, Lord God. For it's not by might, and it's not by power, but it's by your Spirit. And Father God, let your Spirit have its way in me, in Jesus' name, and in this service. Amen. I love to start off with the word. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm a teaching, preaching right. apostle. Right. Huh? Amen. You got to know who you are. Amen. You have to know your graces. Yes. Amen. Amen. 
Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So I like to go in the Word. I like to give the Word. Amen. Hallelujah. So we're going in, and I'm glad I have uh, Pastor Paul there. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. She she read from me the last time when I was under the tent. Amen. Hallelujah. I want you all to turn your Bibles to Mark, St. Mark, and chapter 9. We ain't kind of blowing my... You know, I had my big Bible, and I, I didn't realize till today that I had wore it out. Uh-huh, the, the cover fell off. I was trying to make it last long as it could, but the cover fell off. And I was like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, thank God the word is in my heart. Amen. Can I get an amen? Amen. Amen. You got to have the word in your heart. Amen. amen. He said, heaven and earth will pass away. But my word, it'll last forever. Amen. So that's what we need to be getting, the word in our hearts. Amen. So we can take it with us everywhere we go. Amen. Hallelujah. But I want you to turn to St. Mark. I'm going to start here. Right. Amen. And all of us have our graces. And all of us have our way of delivering. So I'm going to stay in my grace. Amen. I'm going to stay in my way of delivering. Amen. Is that all right with you? Amen. Glory be to God. Now, we're going to begin with verse 14. Amen. In St. Mark. All right. Amen. And it says, And when he came to his disciples, he saw a great multitude about them, and the scribes questioning with them. And straightway all the people, when they beheld him, were greatly amazed, and running to him, saluted him. And he asked the scribes, What question ye with them? This Jesus asking them. And one of the multitude answered and said, Master, I have brought unto thee my son, which has a dumb spirit. And wheresoever he taketh him, he, tar he tarries him, and he foameth and gnashes with his teeth and panteth away. And I spake to thy disciples that they should cast him out, and they could not. Oh, I'm stopping right here for a moment. I'm stopping right here for a moment. If I can get something to lay this down so my Bible will stay there. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. But I want you to key in on what he said. Amen. That his son had a dumb spirit. Amen. In that dumb spirit, he said, took him wherever the spirit wanted to take him. We got to be careful what spirit is carrying us somewhere. Amen. Hallelujah. And I began to look down at the word, amen, dumb spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. See, a dumb spirit want to shut you up. Glory be to God. A dumb spirit is used by the devil to shut you up. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And when you got a dumb spirit, it'll take you wherever you want. Wherever it wants to take you. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. What spirit is moving you today? What spirit are you being led by today? Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. So this dumb spirit, amen, wants to shut you up. Amen. But I know the word of God tells us. Amen. 
who shall ever shall say to this mountain. See, we got to speak. Huh? We're going to speak Jesus talk tonight. Huh? Glory be to God. See, the devil wants to shut us up, so we won't speak the words of God. But God wants to make sure that we are hearing clearly. Amen. And we are declaring his word freely. Huh? Well, you can't declare it freely if you got a dumb spirit trying to shut you up. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God told us to speak to the mountain. You can't speak to it if the devil trying to shut you up. Oh, hello, somebody. Y'all know you got that. Amen. Hallelujah. And it said that the dumb spirit, read, read that verse for me, woman of God. That where it takes him where it will. You ain't gonna be able to 
speak to the mouth. But that's exactly what he wants you to do. Be bound. Can't stand that gnash in your teeth. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord. Speak, Lord. Glory to God. And now, I'm going to take you somewhere. Because I need to continue reading that. Amen. Hallelujah. Continue reading that. Because there's some other points that I want to make concerning that. Amen. Hallelujah. So he took them to, to uh, the disciples and they could not cast it out. So uh, they were telling Jesus. You know what I liked about Jesus? Jesus to stand up for you. Huh? Because Jesus stood up to the scribes and said, What you doing questioning my disciples? Oh, hello, somebody. Y'all didn't catch that. Come on. He said, What you doing questioning my disciples? Right. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We got a father and a son, amen, that'll stand up for us. Amen. Hallelujah. See, when he's our shepherd, he'll protect us. Huh? Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. So, Jesus got into it. When he came, he saw all of this, and, and he saw all the scribes questioning his disciples. And see, he said, why are you questioning me? Amen. Hallelujah. That's when one in the multitude began to speak. Sometimes we speak out about things we shouldn't be speaking out about. And then we hold our peace with things we should be speaking. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. So one in the multitude said, what, woman, woman of God? Yeah, I tell him, it said, O oh, faithless generation, how long shall I be with you? How long shall I suffer you? Bring him unto me. And they brought him unto him, and when he saw him, straight away the spirit tell him, and fell on the ground, and while upon When that devil know you getting close to Jesus, he act up. Yeah. Huh? Amen. 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 He act up. He, I'm, I'm going to get my last bite. Amen. See, when we get, when we born in the world, amen, hallelujah. I don't know why the doctors hit the, hit the baby, the devil getting his first lick. But he ain't got the last that's all right. All right. All right. All right. He did the first week, but he ain't got the last that's all. Amen. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. Right. But that's how the enemy wanna do. Uh -huh. Amen. Hallelujah. When he when he see that you're about to get free, hallelujah, then he cut up the mold. Yeah. You know the higher he build your his nest, the higher you should climb. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. Because the devil don't belong up there with us anyway. He belongs under our feet. Oh, hello, somebody. But we allow him to have conversations with us. Amen. Because we hadn't learned how to talk yet, man of God. We hadn't learned how to talk yet. You see what I'm saying? When you learn how to talk, you know who to talk to. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You know what to say. When to say it. Amen. Hallelujah. See, knowledge speak, but wisdom listen. Come on. Come on. Hallelujah. See, wisdom listen because it said be slow to speak and swift to hear. Glory be to God. Most of the time when you hear about the dumb spirit, the deaf spirit, there too. Amen. Hallelujah. Because the enemy does not, the devil does not want you to hear clearly. And he does not want you to speak. He want to silence you. Amen. Hallelujah. And when you keep all that in yourself, you'll be just like the dumb spirit. Walling in and walling and foaming at the mouth because you got stuff in you that need to come out. You trying to talk, you trying to do something, but he's hindering you. That's a hindering to your spiritual growth. Then Jesus said, Amen. He didn't say nothing about the, he didn't directly say to the disciples. See, y'all got to listen and read and, and, and read the word. 
Amen. Amen. And all that getting, getting understanding. Amen. He didn't say to the old faithless disciples. You see what I'm saying? All right. He said, oh, faithless generation. I <laughs> mean, you in that generation Come that on. ain't believing. And this is the generation we in wow. now. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. Where everybody want to talk like the world. Amen. Hallelujah. I was sitting there, and I promise you God gave me this. People like to say, uh, tell them what. What's up? Well, I said, what's up is God. He's up. Amen. Glory be to God. The world always want to change the things of God and make us follow His pattern instead of God's pattern. That's it. Glory be to God. But we are in this world, but not of this world. Glory be to God. So Jesus said, I see this whole generation. Look at all of them. Amen. Hallelujah. Ain't got no faith. Amen. And see, faith comes by hearing. That's why the enemy wants to give you the deaf and the dumb spirit. And ain't enough to keep your mouth shut, but he don't want you to hear either. Amen. He said, he that has an ear, let him hear what the spirit is saying to the church. Amen. When you don't hear right, you ain't got your directions right. Amen. Amen. Because we get instructions through the word of God. Amen. That's why he don't want you to speak it. He don't want you to hear it. Because he don't want you to know the instructions. And he don't want you to follow it. Because he wants to take you wherever he will. Like he's doing the dumb spirit. Amen. Begin to read. And he asked his father, how long is it ago? Oh, you think that's, that, that just sounds so pitiful, don't it? If I can do anything. See, right now you're talking out of faith. If, if you can do anything. See, if anybody, if somebody asks me, amen, and glory be to God, if you can uh, help me with the left, that means you don't believe I can. You doubting whether I can or can't. If you, if you can. If you can't, read that again. How he was asking Jesus. If thou can't do anything, have compassion on us. First he gave the, uh, his story. Amen. He had already told what the uh, a child was doing, right? But he went further. He threw him all in the fire. Okay, go ahead. Stop it right there. That's really good. Right. Amen. First of all, glory be to God. We like to put things on God. Huh? If you can do anything. God done did everything through Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. It ain't no if, and, and but about it. Amen. Amen. Through his son, he has accomplished everything. And his son gave us the power to tread over serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. Hallelujah. So you see how Jesus answered. See, Jesus is smart. Oh, boy, Jesus knew how to answer you. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to do some Jesus talk tonight. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Uh, Jesus said, if you can believe. He said, if you can do it. He said, if you can believe. Amen. In other words, he was putting it on God. If you can do anything, have compassion on us. Like Jesus was, amen, responsible for all of that. But Jesus throwed it right back at him. Amen. A lot of us said we waiting on God. And God waiting on us. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. Because Jesus gave us all the power. Yes, Lord. He dealt over the enemy. Amen. He delegated that power. The whole I have given you power. Yes. 
to tread over serpents yeah. and scorpions yeah. and over all yeah. the power yeah. of the enemy. Yeah. Glory be to God. So you saying, if first of all you coming into me in doubt, if you can do anything. The word of God says that he that cometh to God yeah. must believe that he is. And that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. See, when you come to, to God, you are you should already believe he can do it. You don't ask him that question. You got to be careful how you come into God and then want him to answer you. He said, if you come in doubt, he said, a double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Let him think that he... Don't let him think that he can receive anything of the Lord. Lord. So this is what he came ill. You see, ill. Remind me how the devil did Jesus. If you be the son of God. Amen. Hallelujah. See, that ill is to put doubt. Huh? Amen. Amen. You doubting that he could do it? Amen. Hallelujah. It's, it's one man didn't do Jesus like that. I think he was, uh, I believe he had leprosy or, 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 or he may have been blind. He said, I know that you can. But if you will, you know, heal me. Hallelujah. See, he approached him in the right now. I know you can. But if you will. And Jesus turned around and said, I will. You see what I'm saying? Because it's God's will for us to be healed. Amen. Hallelujah. We got to be careful for how we approach our maker. Amen. You can't approach him in doubt and expect him to move for you. Amen. Because when God called you, he called you with power. Somebody turn to Matthews uh, 10 and 1. I know spirit of truth out of heaven. Amen. Ten and one. Oh, uh, Minister Kim. And when he had called unto him his twelve disciples, he gave them power against unclean spirits to cast them out and to heal all manner of sickness and all manner of disease. Amen. See, when Jesus came, it said Jesus came preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So uh, the gospel of the kingdom of God was good news. Good news. You don't have to be sick. Good news. You don't have to be broke. Good news. Hallelujah. You don't have to be lonely. Good news. Because the word of God said, I didn't make man to be alone. You know, we got a lot of folks on. I just want to live by myself. Well, I'm telling you, I don't want to live by myself. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Glory be to God. See, you are hinder your own talk. We got to do the Jesus talk. Don't confess nothing in you that's not in Jesus. Amen. God, if God said, I won't have you to be alone, he meant just that. That it ain't good for you to be alone. Oh, hello, somebody. Come on. Let's go. I ain't going to say nothing. You know, I don't use my cool pit to talk about folks. Come on. Because, see, I'm here to, amen, win souls for Christ. Amen. 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 I I don't like to give a minute talking about what somebody do or what they ain't or what they are. Amen. You took away from preaching the gospel of the good news. Amen. 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 You see what I'm saying? When I get this mic, I'm glad that I can declare the good news. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Glory be to God. See, that's what Jesus came. He came to let you know that you don't have to be sick. You don't have to be bound. You don't have to have all these dumb spirits and deaf spirits. Amen. Upon you. Because I have come that they might have life and have life more abundantly. Amen. Amen. Not just have life, but abundant life. Amen. 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 Yeah. You know, I walked in here with so much joy. Amen. Hallelujah. Because the joy of the Lord is my strength. Amen. That's where I get my strength from. Yeah. The joy 
joy of the Lord. Amen. But see, the enemy don't want you to walk in your strength. Amen. Hallelujah. The enemy don't want you to talk. Amen. That's his job. Amen. Hallelujah. And a lot of times people want the enemy to feel sorry for him. See, Jesus will never feel sorry for him. The man at the pool of Bethesda, he was saying, Lord, you know, every time, amen, hallelujah, I get ready to get in the pool. Somebody go ahead of me. See what they, they're doing? We shouldn't be focusing on what is somebody else doing. All right. Huh? Amen. We right. shouldn't be focused on right. what somebody else is doing. That's right. Amen. 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 Your focus should be on what God can do for you. Yes. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. So, so the man told this little sorry story. You know, I, I mean, it, 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 it was, you know, a pitiful story. He no, said, bro. you know, and I can't get myself every time I try to do somebody get ahead of me and they get in the pole and, and, and this is what he said and they get in the pool before me and no one will help me. We love to blame other folks for what condition we are in. Every decision you made brought you to where you are now. Amen. Hallelujah. If you're not a baby, now baby can say that. Nobody can help you. Huh? But I believe Jesus said once you get past 12, all that talk need to cease. Huh? Amen. You got to help yourself. Your help is in the Lord. Amen. He's a very present help in the time of trouble. But we like to put him in the past. You know, we like to push him in the future. We don't like for him to stay right here. I want you right here with me, Lord. Right here with me. Amen. Because you are my very present help in the time of trouble. Amen. Hallelujah. And before I knew God, like I knew God now, you know, that, that was way early in my teens, you know, early 20s. Know, just coming to know God. When I read all of those stories, you know what I was thinking in my mind. I would never say it though. Yeah. Thank God I didn't say it. Amen. But I was thinking in my mind. It was like Jesus all oh, had. He wasn't feeling sorry for the man. No, he wasn't feeling sorry. He was feeling compassion. There's a difference between feeling sorry and feeling compassion because feeling compassion means, okay, you are in this condition, but there is hope. Feeling sorry means there is no hope. And a lot of us want folks to feel sorry for Amen. And a lot of us want to talk the way the world talks just to get some pity. Huh? You see what I'm saying? So I was looking at that. I didn't understand God. I don't understand it now. You know, when, 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 when the word of God, amen, hallelujah, told Saul and him to go in there and kill all the Amalekites <laughs> and all the babies in That's the it. church. You know what I thought then? Being the baby Christian I was in the carnal mind, I still look like God. Mean gonna kill up all of them babies and everybody. But them was demons. There you go. Come on. Come on. When you come, when you are fully taken over by a devil, you are no longer that person. You are a demon. And God had to kill the seed. Amen. And see, Saul, that one went away. That's why the seed still went rapid. You see what I'm saying? You got to kill and destroy the seed. Because if the seed there, it can grow again. That's it. Fruit can come up again. Come on. Glory be to God. Come on, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God. Give the reed, He gave him power. Come on, Lord God. Somebody say Amen. A lot of us say we call, 
And you know what? What a call. Many a call that you chose. All right. Amen. Amen. So you are called. Them, amen, that are chosen are the ones that going to do it God way. Amen. God ain't got no disrespect to person. He just know you're going to do it God way. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Begin to read. Oh, no, you don't, don't go to the, skip on to the five, uh, verse five. See, I, uh, The dumb spirit, he want to shut your mouth up. Well, I, I can't preach. I, I can't do it. If you know the Lord Jesus Christ, he said, if you continue in my word, then are ye my disciples. Amen. 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 And any disciple of God can preach. Amen. See, because you preaching, that don't mean he don't call you to be a pastor. Right. Y'all got to rightly divide the word of truth. Amen. That's right. Hallelujah. But you got to be a disciple of God before you can be, amen, a pastor that he called. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. You got to be a follower of him. You got to know his doctrine. Oh, glory to God, somebody. Glory to God. Look at somebody and say, we're going to do some Jesus talk. We're going to do some Jesus talk. <laughs> Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. Now, what he said, go not in the way of the Gentiles. We shouldn't be going in the way of the world. When you go preach, amen. Hallelujah. Read that when you go preach. That means I got to say something. Yeah. Ain't that right? That's right. I got to say something. You can't let the devil shut your mouth up. Amen. Right. Amen. You got to say something. Amen. Amen. Some people, I, I, I just be quiet. Well, I be quiet till you tell me to talk. Amen. 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 It's a time to be quiet. And it's a time to speak. Amen. It's a time to be silent. And a time to speak. That's what the word of God says. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Our problem is we just don't want to be bold enough to challenge, to, to speak to that demon and tell it to go. Amen. And then we want, God ain't put no shame and no fear in us. You got to speak to that mountain. That's an obstacle in your way. Amen. Hallelujah. The obstacle in your way may be a different obstacle in my way, but we both got to speak to the obstacle. Amen. 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 As you go, preach, saying the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Amen. Amen. Glory be to God. If it says as you go, gossip, did I, I don't know. Did it say that as you go, gospel? Uh, no. Uh -uh, I don't think. I don't think it said. Our apostle said it, 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 it didn't say that. And the other man of God said it didn't say that either. Hey Amen. What you say? Did it say as you go, gospel? I mean, gospel. You know, both ones stand with it. Start uh. with a G. That's why we need to get knowledge. He, that's why we need knowledge. He said, my people perish for lack of knowledge. See, a dumb spirit, you ain't got no knowledge. Ain't that right? You don't have any knowledge. And he said, that's how you're going to perish. See that? That, that young man, if Jesus hadn't uh, uh, spoke to that foul spirit and told him to leave him, eventually it was going to kill the little young man. Because the spirit was throwing him 
in the fire, you know for yourself, you ain't gonna throw yourself in no fire. Amen. What spirit is leading you? Amen. Hallelujah. What's hindering your talk today? Amen. Hallelujah. I ain't gonna say it. I just didn't want the this, and I just you didn't want to be. Uh, amen. Amen. And stand up to the devil. Amen. But in order for you to be free, yeah. amen, you got to stand up to the devil. Yeah. Jesus said, I came to save that which was lost. Yeah. Amen. amen. See, our soul was lost. Yeah. It said that. It didn't say you. That. Amen. When you got born again, your spirit got born again. Amen. But your spirit, body, and soul. Yes. But your soul didn't get saved. Amen. But your spirit, born again spirit, amen, will help that soul to be lined up and under subjection to the spirit of God. That's how come it said be ye transformed and not conform to the world. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And the way you transform yourself is through the word of God. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Glory be to God. It brings about that change to you. You got the heart. You, you, you say you got God. Your spirit is redeemed. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. But your whole body and soul got to be blameless. Amen. That's what Paul said. Amen. Amen. That was in uh, first or second Thessalonians. He said, I pray your whole body, spirit, soul, and body be blameless. Well, the only way it's going to be blameless is they got to line up with God. Amen. Amen. Then another reason the devil wants to shut your mouth up. Because the scriptures say, he that call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. So he don't want you saved. Amen. He don't want you calling on the name of the Lord. He wants your mouth shut. Amen. Hallelujah. Wave your hands before God tonight. Amen. Hallelujah. Are you ready for some Jesus talk under this tent? Are you ready to walk yeah. now with God? Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. Uh, that, that song said, had a little talk with Jesus. Come on. Yeah. Told him all about my trouble. Yeah. Amen. Well, I had a lot of talk with him. Ain't no real talk. See, y'all y'all, y'all bringing it down. We need to have a lot of talk with Jesus. Amen. 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 Oh, Lord. If you want to change your direction, it looks like you're going in opposite directions of where God wants to take. If you want to close a walk with God, you can be saved, but you need that close a walk with God. Amen. Hallelujah. Get in that line tonight while God is here. Amen. And let the Lord bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God want to take you in directions of, uh, he want to elevate you, amen, hallelujah, but he can't do it because, amen, that dumb spirit, amen, oh, hello, glory be to God, you can die on prayer tonight, give it this night, amen, tonight, hallelujah, hallelujah, don't wait till after the service and give it tonight. Amen. Because when God get through, I'm through. Right. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you. Come in the water while there's trouble. Yes. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. You know, I see, you, 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 know, you know what? God is with you. I'm just going to tell you that right now. He is with you. And he's never going to leave you or forsake you. Because you know what? You can hear the word and you can receive. When you can receive.
receive the word and you can hear the word, you know, God, amen, hallelujah, he come down. Amen. The children of Israel were again to pray because they were in bondage. And God said, I heard that prayer and I came down. And that's what God is saying to you. He heard your prayer and he's already come down in Jesus' name. Amen. 
we're talking about the hearing. Uh huh. And the speaking. See, the enemy don't want to shut your mouth too. Don't say that. You know, I question folks who tell me what not to say. Don't say that. Amen. Because if the Spirit of God leads me, I'm going to open my mouth. Now, if you don't lead me, I ain't opening my mouth. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So God is with you. Hallelujah. And God is going to bless your family, your whole family, and your child. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Because you're, you're going to have children. Mm-hmm. Amen. Amen. But we, we had a, 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 a beautiful couple got married in the church. Uh, I did a funeral and a, and a wedding the same day. Oh, oh, man. Because, see, I was that couple wanted to be married. I was like, well, I want them to be married, too. Amen. Hallelujah. And it was beautiful. Sometimes we look at things the way we want it to be this way and that way. And it's flabbergast. But it's the inner man God looking at. Not the outer man. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And God, you're going to get married. Amen. You're going to get married. That's why I call the children. Go ahead. See, when you get married, the children. Amen. 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 And then as you were sitting down, I heard something about the job. Let me tell you this. God said, you know God said, rest not thyself because of evil doers. Amen. Stay on that job and don't let the devil push you off. See, sometimes the enemy is trying to push us away and God wants to make us stronger than stay. Amen. You know what I believe? Well, see God talking. Amen. See God talking. See, we can't run every time the devil. We got to speak. Amen. You know, when I was younger, I used to run too every every time the devil said something on that job. Oh, well, I'm leaving that job where they being prejudiced and blah 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 blah. God was just making me. You see what I'm saying? And then I looked at my little baby I had at home and I said, Well now I'm gonna keep this job. Right. Amen. When I kept quitting. See, if God gives you something good and you can't be able to see nothing good come easy. You see what I'm saying? And then there you go quitting. He's just making you ready. This is just your stepping stone. That's just, you know, your stepping stone. So you got to come your seed of letting the devil know you can't run me till I'm ready to go. Amen. And that's the way I was with all my jobs. By the time God graduated uh, uh, from college, see, I was in college winning jobs, you know. But by the time I graduated from college and got the good job, I was ready because he had made me. Y'all don't remember right. World Coat. You know, when World Coat worked, y'all remember World Coat. Uh-huh. And then I used to have to process some shoes. And they would put a box on there. And I didn't know no better that, you know, and my daddy taught us to work, right? And so when the boxes came in, and I was supposed to put them together and the the sides together, I was just processing and making the other folk mad because they was like, see, they don't keep wanting us to be processing those boxes that fast like that. And I was like, well, that's what we hired to do work. You know? yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and then I was thinking to myself, this really ain't no hard work. All I'm doing is just packing two shoes together. See, sometimes we make things difficult. But stay just a little while ago. Amen. Amen. And then you're going to see something good happen. Stay just a little while. It's not time to quit yet. Mm-hmm. I have to come one way under this tent to tell you this. Amen.
God bless in this book. Thank you, Mary's son. Amen.
know this ain't gonna happen for you, I'll pull up my foot. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory be to God. Thank you, Lord God. You know, the devil was telling me, I, I think I was 45 and some apostle came along uh, when I was 46, but the devil was telling me, you know, we used to think 40 was old then. Yes. See, I thought it was old till I got to be 68, and I'm like, no, nah, that's young. <laughs> Amen. But, but, but I thought then, and the devil was telling me, oh, you, you know, you can Oh, you know, you ain't no kidding on her sleep. And I pulled my scripture out. And I pulled the promises of God out. And I put it on the devil. And I tell the devil, I'm fearfully and wonderfully made. Hallelujah. And long as I'm saved, I'm fearfully and wonderfully made. You got to tell the enemy. Amen. But be blessed and go get your blessing. Y'all go get y'all blessing. Amen. Go get it. It's out there. Amen. It's out there. But God wanted to make sure y'all was anchored in God. Amen. Because Say it's not good to get riches before you get riches to God. Amen. It destroys you. Amen. So God wants to turn your focus now. He wants to turn it on Him. Hallelujah. So you get rich in Him. And then the things will come. All those things that you desire of coming. Yes, Lord God. There you go. She, she speak that word now. Nobody stop you from reading your word and study. Amen. And y'all read together. And y'all share together. Okay? And sometimes me and the apostles we get up there and we share together. You be over there. And I be over there. We be in the same room. Amen. Sharing insight. Praying together. That makes the marriage strong. Go and be blessed. Amen. 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 God bless. Hey, everybody. Um, we was on our way over here, and we literally got to where the train tracks are. When you come in across, you know, the train really don't come across. It's like the light right there. But we got to the crossing, the rail, and there was no train. No sound of a train, no sign of a train. We got right in front of the train. You wouldn't know about the glory of the Lord. I promise you. We got right in front of the train, and it just don't happen to move the home.
God say in the spirit. And that blessed woman of God. I see a lot of blessed people in here tonight. Yes, Lord. Amen. You're blessed. Yes, Amen. Yes, Hallelujah. You show authority. The woman of God in the way. Amen. them so much. I mean, the spirit of truth. Church, didn't they sing good tonight? Yes. Yeah. Amen. We just have it. Amen. So happy. Amen. To have Amen. Bishop Ramsey with us tonight again. And you tell on the preaching machine. He preached the other night. And his brother preached the night before. Yes. Amen. Amen. We thank God. Amen. For, 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 for that, my good friend preaching him. Amen. Raspberry. Amen. Yes. Amen. Thank God for it. She, she didn't know you, but I told her your mama started this. That's it. That's amen. It. She started this. Amen. I promised her, amen, on her way to heaven that I would try to keep it up. That's it. You know amen. It. God been doing it ever since. Thank God, amen, for, 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 for Sister Amy. Amen. This, this is a promise right here. Ladies, stand right back there. And thank God for her. She is a facilitator. Amen. So we thank God for her. She said, long as she live and after she gone, we can still stay right here. Amen. And praise God. Amen. Thank God for you. Amen. We thank God for you. We, we just happy. Amen. We had a good time tonight. Amen. I'm going to ask you, amen, for an offering. Amen. Please. Amen. Ask you, ask you for an offering tonight. Amen. Take money to do things. Amen. I definitely love to take care of my speakers. Amen. It may not be a whole lot, but we let them take care of it. Amen. I don't know no cash app. Amen. You got a cash app? Oh, no, sorry. Sorry. Dollar sign, I do pray. That's a good one. Yeah, Amen. I hope y'all do pray. <laughs> Amen. But don't y'all be out. Y'all better get her. Y'all better get her cash app. Okay. Amen. I do pray. Amen. Thank God. Amen. For old Sarah Miles, my wife, she, she out there heaven, heaven against the prepared. Amen. Amen. Heaven against the prepared. Amen. All right. Amen. We're going to ask you for an offering. trying to be a free gospel delivery center. We build the kingdom of God. Yes, Amen. So, so the spirit of truth is here. They're over in West End. They want to go over there and get some good teaching? Go. Amen. They some good teaching. Amen. They did, they, they did my ascension. Amen. To make me an apostle. These are the one did it for me. Amen. Some folks say they're apostles. ain't got no kind of proof that they're an apostle. But I got proof right here. Yes, Amen. You can pull up the video see, and see how it sent you. Right. Amen. A lot of y'all was there. Amen. Amen. Thank you, preacher. Amen. Thank you so much. Amen. Thank you for 
think of them for what you've given them. Amen. And now look, we all said good start, and this is just the first week. And you know, we got three weeks here. Amen. So, so please don't, don't, don't say, well, look, I've been, I ain't going back. Come on back. Amen. And help lift up the name of Jesus. That's why we're here. Amen. Some of the neighbors can, 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 can feel Jesus. We're here. So they can hear the gospel in the houses, on the street. That's why we're here. Amen. I could be in, 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 in four walls, but we chose to be out here so they can hear the gospel. A lot of folks ain't going to go to church, but they'll come to the tent right. and they'll pull up in their cars and sit and get the gospel. That's why we're here. That's why Mother Bunny, Pastor Bunny was here. Amen. To get the gospel out. Hope you let me appreciate it. Amen. We're here to get the gospel out. And I dare you, being saints of God, that the devil beat you down and you got a way out and won't take it. Huh? Amen. God give us a way out. You need to take it. Amen. You don't have to be down in your spirit, broke and disgusted and busted, can't be trusted. You got God. Yes. In your life, come on, amen. You can have what you want, then that's what he said, right? right? You can have what you say, right. amen. So please come on, help us put this God out, amen. Thank God for uh, brother, 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 Tumble, brother, Larry Tumble. he's a faithful, faithful brother, man. He, he worked with us at, at the free gospel. Thank God for him. He'd be here earlier to help me sit the stuff out. He, he know how he got old now. Huh? I need help. And I used to talk two speakers myself. I can't do that like I used to no more. Amen. So I thank God for him to come out and the one that, that's been helping us. Get stuff closed up and, get, and everything. That's a blessing. Amen. So sometimes I'll be so tired, I, I'll be too, too tired to go get on my bus. Amen. I wish the bus would come to me. Amen. But nevertheless, amen, we're going to put this gospel out as long as we live. Amen. We're going to do it. And we thank God for you. Thank God for what you give. I'd like to say to the couple that got, got, got married, hang together. Stay together. Pray together. Amen. Do things together. The devil's job is to separate you. That's what his job is. It'll get you looking another way. And when you when, when turn your head and look another way, dig it back. Dig it back. So no, I'm not, I'm not doing that. Amen. Thank God for my wife. And we've been married, married this year 48 years. Amen. Amen. And you can do it. And we got married when we were in our 20s. Amen. So you can do it. Just put God first. Amen. And, and, and most of all, stay with the church. Get that good teaching. Amen. Stay in the Word. That's what's going to put you, put you on up there. The Word of God. Amen. And the devil wish he, he, he wished his wish for all would just go to hell. That's what the devil wish. But guess what? He's not in charge. Amen. He's a liar and the dead ever lie. Amen. The dead ever lie. And you can treat him as such. Amen. Someone said, well, you don't even respect I he ain't got no respect. Amen. I don't respect him. Huh? Amen. Jesus kicked him out of hell. Watch it out. Watch, watch it out. He said, he's so sweet. He's so nice. Kick him out. Get out of here. Amen? Amen. Amen. All right. We thank God. Now, look, they do have some uh, freshmen out there. Amen. For sale. That's what they're doing. Amen. To keep these lights and stuff going, generators going, help us out. Amen. Don't don't go to McDonald's. Just go right out there. They got hamburgers, hot dogs, and they got plates out there. Amen. And all kinds of the stuff out there. So please, patronize them. Amen. So we so we can go go further, huh? Amen. Amen. Thank God for missionary Pauling. Amen. Amen. Hanging with us, helping us out. Thank God for you. Amen. We, we just I, I I I I may be pushing, but I'm looking for your sister to show up. I'm looking for her to show up. Amen. God just told me I'm looking for her to show up. I mean, she got the mantle. She got the mountain. and God gave it to us. And the devil in hell can't not take it away from her. Hallelujah. That's what I believe. That's what I stand on. That's what I know. And that's what I'm going to see. Amen. Amen. So I'm looking for it. Come out. Amen. All right. Amen. In, in, in announcements. In announcements. Amen. I'm new at all this. They do all this. I, I just preach. Amen. 
Amen. And we just thank God. Amen. Thank, thank God for, for the Spirit of God. And we'll be back here tomorrow. Amen. Amen. 7 o'clock. I don't know who I want tomorrow. They do. But uh, we'll be back here tomorrow. And Saturday we'll be off. But Sunday we'll be back in the cell again. Amen. Right here on this tent. Amen. I thank God. Amen. For what he's doing on this tent. Amen. We'll, we'll be here till God say go. We'll go somewhere. And all right. God bless you. And we're we going to turn it back on to the speaker of the hour. Let them have blessed the food and dismiss it. Is that all right? Amen. Don't, don't forget, make a turn and go right on the table out there. <laughs> Amen. God bless you. I thank God for all of you all. Amen. And your patience. Amen. And you are hearing what God had to say. And I thank you all for it. And, um, a bishop, a husband, amen. Beautiful couple. We love them. We love, we love the whole family. <laughs> amen. But um, ready to dismiss. Stand on your feet. Look to the right. Uh -huh. Okay, look to the left. Now look to the right again. Good night. <laughs>